What's up, you guys? This is Mary with ATI High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. It's free general collective reading for all times. Cops, suicide, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. 1.17 p.m. Central Standard Time. Saturday, 7 8, 2023. Hope everybody's doing well. Girl, girl, girl. I do. Okay, so um, I'm going to do this reading. I picked up a lot of channelings. I was just trying to finish my documentation for work, which is done and all that, but so I decided to come on here and uh, put all the channelings out um, that I've received. So I um, hope everybody's doing well. I am picking up on this karmic stepmother again that is the, she's, okay, so she's trying to, of course, it's always only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest, okay? Um, my kitty's playing with me down here. I got this new furniture piece in here and he loves it. So <laughs> he's taking over a little spot on the bottom. Anyways, um, so um, there. Okay, so I keep picking on this up on this karmic stepmother. She doesn't have good intentions for many people. Apparently, there's uh, one particular child she's trying to poison, a masculine child. She's trying to poison a masculine child, but she's actually about to poison her own masculine child. She's trying to poison not her masculine child, somebody else's masculine child. That could be a her stepmother, so it might be her stepchild or somebody else's child. But it's not her masculine child. She's trying to poison. She's actually about to end up poisoning her own masculine child. And I feel that can be an adult or a minor masculine, uh, her own masculine child. Um, and same for the either her stepson or somebody else's son you plug it in how it resonates but um i heard it's about to happen soon because um i heard she's very knowledgeable in poisons um but she i, I just heard now she's about to get it wrong in a huge way um the wrong person so she's very knowledgeable she's very smart um she's obviously done her research on poisons um and i heard she's doing it through food just now she's doing it through food so whatever she's doing she's putting it in some kind of food um, but she's about to poison her own child, her own masculine child, and her goal and target is another masculine child. I just heard for insurance policy money just now. Okay, so she's trying to poison somebody else's. It's probably her stepchild because how is she going to gain insurance policy money off somebody else's? Um, you see what I'm saying? So I intuitively think whoever this is for, and obviously I don't think it's you guys. I think it's somebody you know. This crazy ass karmic stepmother. She wants to gain insurance policy money off this masculine child when he deceases. So I think she has some kind of connection to him, like a legal connection. Um, I heard she'll end up in prison through this. Um, autopsy will re will be revealed on her son. Uh, so when her son ends up passing away, because she's actually going to end up poisoning her own son, um, I heard the father will get involved, and he will not be happy. Okay, so the father, the father will get will be get involved when her son actually passes away. There will be an autopsy performed, and her her ass will end up in prison. But her goal and target was to poison another masculine child. Strongly feel it might be her stepchild because she has some kind of insurance policy um, money connections to this if he passes away. I was just looking at some. So you guys plug it in how it resonates. That's pretty crazy. I keep picking up on it. I did a reading previous about it. I got channeling, but I noticed when I did the reading, I didn't put all the details out on it because I was picking up that other situation. I kept picking it up in the reading. Um, but this is that that I was picking up a couple days ago, except more details. So you guys plug it in how it resonates. I mean, Honestly, she 100% deserves it. Obviously, she's greedy. Um, and obviously. I mean, to the point she wants to kill somebody for insurance policy money. What is wrong with you? Budget your money correctly. If anybody needs to hear that. And quit using 
children as pawns, death pieces. This isn't using a child on a fucking chess board. This is taking them off the fucking chess board. Off of your greedy pocketbooks. What is wrong with you? If you watch Crazy Karmic Stepmother, Um, I just heard a fire sign fan that's helped close and solve many um, important cases in the past. I heard she was left out in the cold financially. She was not rewarded for this. She was not compensated for this. Um, I heard um, the uh, people that helped close and solve the cases, they got the information from her off of free, um, I heard free channel um, just now. So a free channel. So some kind of free channel in the universe, publicly, social media platform. That's how they got the information to solve the cases or close the cases. But she was never compensated, rewarded, or anything of that nature. She's fire sign femme. She can have Aries, Leo, Sag, any aspects of her charts. For some, I feel you can be her. Um, and I just heard a water sign femme, too. Uh, fire sign femme and a water sign femme. So uh, Aries, Leo, Sag, and a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, femme. Um, whoever you are, you have to play yourself in. But you were... Whoever has been solving and closing these cases, they got the information to help solve and close these cases, water sign them or um, fire sign them, off your free public platform, your free channel. Um, so I think you do a channel on YouTube like I do. And I don't think you charge for it, like me. Um, now, my members only is coming, but it hasn't occurred yet. But I know a lot of you guys, it's free. So, But for me, Sears Chain Vince, um, I just heard a lar large compensation just now. Large compensation. Some kind of large compensation is about to occur. Um, I don't know if this is a reward. Uh, uh, maybe you actually get hired on by one of one of these people. I'm assuming it's a police detective, police investigator, private investigator, bounty hunter, something like that. Somebody that's closing and solving cases, but they're using your information to do it. So I feel it could be any of those things. A police investigator. Um, um, police officer, maybe, um, uh, private investigator, a bounty hunter, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, some kind of large compensation coming soon. So, like I said, I don't know if they're going to hire you for their services or, um, maybe give you some kind of public recognition and honor, maybe reward money or however that resonates. You're a fire sign femme, water sign femme, kids, prices, Scorpio femme. Aries Leo Sagittarius. How that resonates in the box? I just heard very gifted. Just now. You're very gifted. So whoever you are, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Fem, Aries Leo Sag, Psychic Investigator, just heard. You're psychic investigators, you're very gifted. You have an online public platform with the channel. Um, I just heard um, an NFL football player is about to be um, publicly humiliated for sex trafficking. Someone in his um, his home city. Um, I heard it's been it's already been exposed by people on teammates. I just heard teammates, people on his team, and then I heard teammates. Um, and <clears throat> um, I heard he's about to be kicked off the team. Um, and I heard it's about to humiliate his family. In the home city that he sex trafficked, um, I heard of Femme Energy and her family. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So some kind of masculine. He's an NFL football player right now. Um, National Football League. He is currently NFL football player right now. But his own teammates knows he's a, he's sex trafficked a Femme and her family. So kid or kids. I'm assuming either her kid or kids or somebody else's kid or kids. And a Femme Energy in his home city. He's They know he's sex trafficked her. Um, 
it sounds like it's about to get to the manager of this team. I didn't hear which team it was. Um, or people that can kick him off. Um, I heard contract null and void just now. Contract null and void. Breach of contract just now. So, obviously, yeah, if you're sex trafficking people, how the hell? Uh, I, I would say that's a breach of contract. <laughs> um, why would any football team want <laughs> someone on their their football team knowing this chick, he sex trafficked, it sounds like past energy, lives in his home city. So he lives in a, he's from a city, city in urbanized area. She lives in that city or did live in that city. And he, he's from that city. Um, but why would these teammates and this ball team and this manager of this ball team, this NFL football team, want this dude on the team? I heard they don't. Yeah. Because it tarnishes public reputation to be known you're connected to sex trafficking. Um, I heard he's about to, uh, he's about to go to jail very soon. For this and other things. Yeah, well, he's into dirty sex trafficking and some other negative things. He's about to go to jail soon. And I heard he's about to publicly humiliate his family that's from this home city. Or connected to this home city that he's from. Uh, well, I mean, that was his free willing choice to get into this shit. I mean, that's nasty as hell. It's a masculine football player, NFL, I heard. I feel for some, you might be his football player um, teammates that watch my channel. Or the manager, that w or managers that watch this channel. Or somebody's going to show you this uh, video. How that resonates and applies. Okay, I heard a um, very high vibrational female energy is about to get an unexpected package soon. I heard she did not order this package. Um, it's about to be delivered via FedEx. Um, I heard um, I heard it's not poisonous. It's important. You're actually going to get it this time. Open it. You plug it in, how it resonates. <laughs> so if this resonates for you, your high vibrational female energy, um, you may any sign. I'll pull some signs in a minute, but I heard you've had severe problems with your male in the past. Severe. I heard for years, just now. So whoever you are, have vibrational female energy. You've had severe problems with your male for years. So two or two plus years. Years are strategically. Strategically, you've had problems with your male for years. So I think people have been stealing your male, withholding your male. Um, with oh, probably, I'm assuming not your bills, but other important stuff. I, I'm feeling some kind of gifts they've been withholding or taking, or um monitoring or blocking or something from you for, from you to get but this one i heard you're going to get it's going to come from fedex high vibrational thin energy so be looking out for a fedex truck just saying just saying or somebody you're connected to be looking out for a fedex truck um and um i heard it's not poisonous so no anthrax or nothing like that involved i'm assuming no bombs or crazy shit um and it's some kind of gift for you. You did not purchase this or do this. Somebody else has done this. Um, and I heard you're going to get it this time. So I think whoever is sending this to you, high vibrational film, they've tried to send you something in the past, but it got blocked or somebody else stole it or um, somebody was monitoring your mail because your mail is very, it's been heard heavily screened. It's been heavily screened for years, ma'am. Um, which is terrible, but you're going to get this time. I heard, um, take it, open it. And I just heard accept it. So of course you have free will. You don't have to do those things, but that's what I heard from the spiritual realm. Of course, everybody has free will on here. You don't have to take it, open it, accept it. But if this ends up resonating for you and I heard it's going to happen soon, it's going to happen soon. So within the next week, I just heard soon within the next week. So we're Saturday, 7, 8, 2023. So Within um, July 15th of 2023, that's next Saturday, um, you will receive this package. I don't know if it's small, medium, large, what have you. It's something. It will be delivered through FedEx. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates.
I just heard a karmic couple in a city is about to be exposed for sex trafficking soon. I heard they don't want it to come out very publicly because it will tarnish their uh, public reputation. And I heard their public re re reputation is very dear, near and dear to them. Um, but I heard their ass is about to be jailed. They're about to be charged. I heard indicted. Char jail, charged, indicted. So I don't know if this is on a federal level, police level, or, you know, like a local level police or both. I don't know. Jail, charged, and indicted. Um, it's a man and woman karmic couple. I heard they're legally married. Man and woman karmic couple. I feel they reside in a city and not an urbanized area because I heard they don't want their city to know. So I think they live in a city. Um, and they don't want to come out real public. They're heavy into sex trafficking. I heard child sex trafficking just now. Child sex trafficking. Um, they don't want their city to know because their public reputation is really near and dear to their heart. But really, and that's great. But you have to actually be upright. If you want a steady public reputation, You, I mean, hell, at least on here, I've admitted all the shit I've done in the past. And that's just the truth. Good, bad, and the ugly. Um, these people like to hide what they've done. Um, still do the net. I mean, in child sex trafficking, that's the lowest low, low. That's shit on the shoe internet. Um, and it's a man and woman, man and woman legally married karmic couple. Um, uh, I feel strongly feel they reside in a city and nice urbanized area. Her jail charged indicted. So I think the feds are involved or about to get involved. Or maybe, maybe police can do indictments. I don't know. I'm not, I don't work in the police sector, but. You guys plug it in, how it resonates. I heard they have gotten in way over their heads. This karmic couple, man and woman karmic couple. They've gotten in way over their heads. I heard feds do know. Police do know. And I heard um, they are about to take action soon because it's gotten way out of hand. And um, there have been many reports saying that they've been trying to gather their evidence. So it's gotten way out of hand, this child sex trafficking. Police do know. I'm feeling their local police know and feds know, but it sounds like they've been doing the investigation, either locally, fed level, or both. To try, I heard to gather their evidence, but and I heard there's a shit ton of it. There's a shit ton of evidence, but it's gotten way out of hand. So I think they got messy and sloppy. I heard they're very messy. Yeah. Well, how the hell do they expect to maintain their public reputation as Glittering and gold when they're fucking sex child sex traffickers. I heard it's gotten way out of hand, so I think, and I heard they're very messy. So I think they have just done this whatever this weird sex trafficking business is. To everybody and their mama, and some and some people have I think reported it to the feds or police or is about to. But I heard the feds and police already have evidence. I heard they're about to get more. And they're about to get more. Yeah. So they already have evidence. I think some of these people have already reported it. And more are about to report it. For some, you could be the ones that have reported it or about to report it. But these people are very messy. So they're not careful. They're not uh, even skilled in this, it sounds like. It sounds like they have put their hands in way too many honey pots And just been very haphazard with this shit. Um, but the thing is, is they deserve to be caught because child sex trafficking is terrible. It truly is. Um, I don't feel any sympathy, empathy, or remorse for these people. And that's just the truth. Because you would, should never abuse and exploit anybody, especially not children. And that's just the truth. Hashtag save the kids. Oh my God, I heard of Aries Fem politicians about to get charged with um, child sex trafficking. And I heard she's connected, very um, has been very heavily connected, I heard in the past, to this karmic couple. Man, woman, legally married karmic couple. But she's somebody else. Aries Fem politician, she's about to get charged with child sex trafficking. I think she's, they're going to, the police feds or both are going to connect her to them. Um, I heard she was very heavily connected to them in the past, probably because of this. Um, she could have areas of any aspects of her chart. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, moon, and energy of her chart. She's feminine energy, and she is a politician. I just heard Florida is very significant, so I think she might be a politician in Florida, live in Florida, be from Florida, or have connections in Florida, or they could. Um, Flo somehow Florida is significant to this child sex trafficking exposure. 
um, I heard in, in Alabama, in Tennessee. So Florida, Alabama, and Tennessee is very significant to this child, child sex trafficking situation. And this Ari Spin politician and this karmic man, woman, legally married karmic couple. State of Alabama, state of Tennessee, and the state of Florida. Um, so you plug it in, how it resonates. State of Alabama, state of Florida, state, state of Tennessee. Whoa! I just heard a child's um, webcam um, footage. Um, I heard um, she's a cam girl. I uh, heard she's a teenager, a minor fem teenager's um, webcam footage. She's a cam girl. Um, so sex work on cams, basically. Um, I heard it's about to be, uh, I heard it's already gotten to feds. But the IP address and all the electronic information is about to be heavily traced by the feds. I heard through many series of chain events it's about to get shut down. And it's about to um, alarm the hell out of family members, particularly a karmic father. So, um, and I heard uh, the feds are coming for your ass, karmic father, is what I just heard. And I heard you need to hear this and you watch the channel. You plug it in how it resonates, karmic father. You obviously didn't have good intentions for her. I wonder if she lives in your household. Or you know about it. She doesn't even have to live in your household. Um, I heard she does. Yeah, she lives in your household. Um, I think you convinced her, groomed her to do this shit. You sick ass. Um, but the feds come for your ass. And they should. Karmic father, whoever you are. I don't know what sign you are. But um, feds are on to you. Uh, but the webcam shit, she's a minor, so she shouldn't even be doing this anyways. Um, that's against the law for any minor, for anybody doesn't know, 17 or below, it's against the law for any 17 or below, anybody, to be doing any kind of sex work online, period. That's against the law. And I'm sure he knew this, but it was probably making him a lot of money. But it's about to be shut down, Carmen Father, and the feds are coming for you ass. She's 17 or below. She can be any sign. She lives in your household. And you watch my channel. All right. You be a Virgo or dealing with Virgo. And I don't feel sorry for you either, Karmic Father. You should never mind controlled and mind manipulated and groomed her ass. You be a Cancer dealing with Cancer. You be a Libra or dealing with Libra. Double Virgo energy. Give me a Leo or dealing with the Leo. Give me a Gemini or dealing with the Gemini. Double leaves. Give me a Caps or dealing with Caps. Triple Libra. I definitely think when you guys are Libra, dealing with Libra. Give me a Pisces or dealing with Pisces. Quad quadruple Libra. Double Leo. And Aquarius. You mean Aquarius are dealing with Aquarius? I heard stop. I just heard the karmic clone doppelgangers have quit um have quit cloning and doppelganging a particular high vibrational thin energy. Uh, okay, so we had some kind of attack of the clone war shit, uh, which I just pull out that in for good lord uh, for a while. <laughs> attack of the clone wars, doppelganger energy, um, fems. I heard fems. Um, fems I. So two or plus fem, two or two plus fems were cloning and imitating and doppelganging another particular very high vibrational fem energy, um, either aesthetically, externally, or copying her energy, or both. But you can never copy the inside if anybody needs to hear that. But um, they quit doing it now. I heard they can't do it now. They can't do it now. Well, good. Because you should be your fucking self. 
And that's just true. Be your fucking self if you need to hear that clone doppelganger karmic shits. Yeah, your shits doing that to somebody. Just saying, just saying. Your fins. I just heard an angry grandmother spirit, cancer energy. Um, she's in the spiritual realm. I heard she's been harassing the hell out of a particular air sign in a dream state. Um, I heard it's about to get worse, and you need to hear that. You're a terrible person, and she has seen what you've been doing for years. And I just heard God knows, too. Oh, my God. Whoa. <laughs> okay, air sign. <clears throat> You're obviously a low vibrational air sign. Oh my God, I just heard gay for pay. Oh my God. Um, and other terrible things just now. Gay for pay and other terrible things. So you're a karmic air sign masculine. Um, you have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, any aspect. Oh, well, I didn't hear your masculine. Um, actually, I, I didn't hear your masculine, but I just heard it's masculine and femme. So your masculine and femme, karmic air sign energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, man, and, man or woman. There's at least two of you. But there's some kind of grandmother spirit in the spiritual realm she's a cancer grandmother spirit so she's already passed over she's in the spiritual realm she's been haunting you in your dream state man or woman air sign energies um gemini libra Aquarius energies something about gay for pay and other terrible things i just heard ashley madison gay for pay ashley madison sex trafficking and sex trafficking um gay for pay ashley madison and sex trafficking cancer Grandmother spirit has been haunting you in dream state. I heard it's going to get worse. And I heard she has known what you've been doing for years and God knows. So however that resonates, we don't get into religion on here, whether you believe in God or not, but I think she might believe in God. I think I'm channeling her. So I'm just saying, I heard she knows and God knows. So I think she believes in God. Air signs. I think you know this. I heard uh, someone has somebody else's uh, money, and um, I heard through many series chain events, they're about to be forced to give it up. And I heard this many energies. I heard they all worked together in the past, uh, very strategically to steal it from her, but through many series of chain events, they're about to have to give it up to her. So many energies work very strategically. Like I feel gang energy, gang or cult or mafia energy or some shit, greedy ass people energy, I'll tell you that. Um, whether they're in a gang, cult, mafia or not. But they all ganged up on her. I heard they did it very stinkily, shyly behind the scenes, so they never told her. Obviously. Why the hell would you tell her? Oh, yeah, I'm going to steal from you. No. Um, obviously not. But I heard through many series of changes, they're about to have to give it to her. So, um, that's what you get for stealing from folks. Crazy asses. Just saying, just saying. And I just heard, just now, a, a dark web, um, a dark web uh, business, sex trafficking, that was very, very, very profitable. I heard um, for years in the past um, in another person's home. I heard the um, the feds know about it and they're about to be on your ass and you know who you did it. Uh, you know who you are that did it. That's what I heard. So some kind of dark web energy, uh, sex trafficking. That could be of an adult, kids or both. Um, and they did it by doing it in somebody else's home. So hidden camera energy, obviously. I mean, how else were they going to do it? Hidden camera energy, hidden, a listening um, device energy, or a combination of both. But they did it straight, strategically in somebody else's home to webcam, dark web energy, to sex traffic them. I think you guys watched my channel, Weird Dark Webcam Sex Traffickers. I heard um, feds are on your ass. 
And I heard they're going to keep being on your ass. And I heard they're about to move in soon. Just now. They're about to move in soon. Well, good. They should. I don't feel sympathy and empathy for that either. I mean, go out and do things the right way if anybody needs to hear that. These people are so fucking whack. I don't feel sorry for these people. I really don't. They had the free willing choice to do things right in the in the past. And they chose to sex traffic people. And to the point, they it probably forcibly implanted a hidden camera or listening device or devices or trackers on this high vibrational fem energy to do it. Nobody in, deserves their invasion of, of their privacy invaded, their right, civil rights violated, or anything of that nature because it's exactly what the fuck you guys did. Be my needs to hear that. And you wouldn't appreciate it if it was done to you. Confirmation from my fat boy. Okay, I heard a very high vibrational fem energies um, YouTube channel has been shadow banned for years. I heard years, uh, two or two plus years. But I heard through many series of chain events, and I heard this is about to happen soon. It's about to start going and going very fast. I heard the settings have been jacked all to hell, um, and it was somebody in YouTube that had connections outside of YouTube to do this. But I heard it's about to be fixed by somebody else in YouTube heard a very important phone call just now. A very important phone call is about to be made. Set. I heard the settings are about to be fixed and it's about to go like wildfire. So you plug in how it resonates. And I heard the other person that works in YouTube, they're about to be fired. So you plug in how it resonates. So, um, and okay, and I got the person that is about to be fired in YouTube. They are about to report the person that manipulated them to block the um, settings once they get fired. So, um, you for some, you could be the high vibrational fem energy um, YouTube channel that's been blocked. For some, you could be this crazy ass employee that was manipulated by somebody outside of YouTube to strategically block her um, channel by manipulating, screwing the settings out of hell. For some, you could be the person that mani uh, manipulated the person in YouTube to do it. For some, you could be the important phone call in YouTube that's about to help fix it. Um, for some, you could be the person in YouTube about to fire this person. You have to plug yourself in where you fit, as always, okay? I heard it's about to start going so, so, so fast. Her channel. Her channel is about to start going so, so, so fast. In a positive way, just now. Her channel is about to start going so, so, so fast in a positive way. Well, congratulations, ma'am. You've been shadow banned. Uh, and I heard you know you have been. Yeah. But it's been going on for two or two plus years. So you've had your channel at least two years. Like, I've had mine a, a little over three. Um, you've had yours at least two. Um, so you plug in how it resonates. Whoa. Mm, oh my god, I heard a Taurus fam is um I heard she's becoming very successful on YouTube. I heard spiritualist. Um I heard um beware ma'am because you have a crazy ex of the past. He's gonna try to reconnect with you. I heard do not do it. He's he's a money hungry. That's what I just heard. He's money hungry. You're a Taurus fam spiritualist, you're becoming very, very, very um you have a channel on YouTube, you're becoming very, very, very successful. I think he watches your channel. I heard he does. He does. Oh, my God. And I think you watch my channel. That's why I'm getting it. I think you watch my channel, and he, I heard he watches your channel. But he is a masculine ex of your past, Taurus Fem Spiritualist. You have Taurus in any aspect of your charts. You're becoming very successful on YouTube. I think he sees your view count. I think he sees that you're getting AdSense or revenue or you're getting donations or something very successful with your channel, Taurus Fem. I think you definitely watch my channel. That's why I'm getting this channeling. And I he definitely watches your channel. But he's about to reach out to you soon. I heard do not communicate with him. Of course, you can take the spiritual downloads or not. I heard he's a gold, he's gold digger. He's wanting the money is what it is. He's seeing your channel become super successful. You're a Taurus fam. You can have Taurus in any aspect of your charts. I heard you're very gifted. I think you have uh, gifts in some shape, form, or fashion. But you're racking that money in right now. But I think he sees it by your view counts. Um, how many 
how much content you're putting out. Um, maybe you mentioned you've gotten donations or something of that nature. Of course, fam, be careful. Or do, it wouldn't be smart to allow him back. Of course, you could have free will and allow him back, but I'm just saying, okay? Okay, I heard a, um, a Leo, Fem's karmic father, her biological father. Uh, her, he's not really her biological father, but he's uh, she's um, she has been made to believe he's her biological father uh, her whole life. I heard he's about to pass away, and I heard it's about to be the best thing that ever happened to you. Um, so you plug in how it resonates for Leo, Fem, um, if this resonates for you. But you have a father. I heard a karmic father, so he's never... Um, had any good intentions for you in any shape, form, or fashion, whether, you, I mean, I'm sure you know this. I heard you do. Yeah, you know it. You know he's a karmic father, but I heard he's about to pass away soon. Um, but he's not, if you didn't know this part, um, he's not your real father. He, I heard you were made to believe your whole life that he was your real biological father, but I heard he's actually not any relation to you. But he's about to pass away, and he's about to be, it's about to be the best thing that ever happened to you. Um, and I just heard in such a huge way, in such a huge way, ma'am, you have Leo in any aspects of your charts, only you're going to know if you, um, there's a death upcoming of the biological father. That's not really your biological father. Um, how that resonates and applies. I heard he lives very far distances from you just now. He lives very far distances from you, Leo Finn. So you plug it in, how it resonates. But I heard it's going to be the best thing that ever happened to you. I heard in so many ways, in so many ways. So it's going to be the best thing that ever happened to you when he passes away in so many ways. All right, let's see if I get anything else. Okay, I just heard the pregnancy of a Taurus femme and a Leo femme in a workplace situation is about to become very significant in many people's lives. So, 3D workspace energy, pregnancy of a Taurus femme and a Leo femme. They can have Taurus or Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Femme, and any of your charts. It's about to become very significant in many people's lives. So, I think you guys know this Taurus femme or the Leo femme, or you are the Taurus femme or the Leo femme. Whoever these people are, they work in the 3D workspace. And y'all know I work full-time. I'm a home health nurse. But I'm not pregnant. Hell, I hadn't had sex in about four and a half years. So it's not me. But some other, and I'm a Leo son. That's why I say that. But it's some Taurus fem or Leo fem. Uh, they can have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, and Manhattan, and Jupiter charts, or Mercury chart. But um, they're pregnant. Um, and they work in 3D workspace. So it's about to become significant. I feel in either, either in a good or a bad way. To you guys, or maybe for some, you are them. Like I said, I'm a Leo son, but I'm I'm not pregnant. Hell, there's been no penis, and that's just the truth. <laughs> I didn't break <laughs> That'd be the immaculate conception if I've ever heard it. All right, I love you guys so much. Let me see if I get anything else. Okay. Oh my God. I heard there's about to be a very significant breakup between a Libra femme and her boyfriend that lives in the same um, subdivision as her. Um, and I heard um, they're going to try to keep it very private, but it's actually um, many people are about to know they're about to break up. And I heard there's going to be probably, I heard probably just now, probably. So it might most likely will happen, but not set in stone will be a very significant argument between you, uh, not you and her, him and her, I heard, him and her in a front yard. Um, that's about to become very significant, but I heard this is the final breakup. Um, I heard he's been using her 
And she's about to get a huge wake up call and realize he's been using her. I don't know. <laughs> I don't have a boyfriend. Y'all know that. <laughs> uh, and I, I have Libra in my chart, but this ain't me. <laughs> I don't have a boyfriend, but it's a Libra fan. She can have Libra in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, or feminine, and Jupiter charts. Her boyfriend lives in the same subdivision as her, though. Um, so she can live by herself or not. He can live by herself, his self or not, but they don't live together. I'll tell you that right now. They don't live together, but they live in the same subdivision. But they're about to break up. I heard she is about to realize that he has been using her in a huge way. And I heard he has. He has been using her in a um, huge way. Um, but there's about to be a significant breakup. I don't know if he's about to break up with her or she's about to break up with him. For some, you can be these people. I'm not sure. But she's about to have a huge wake-up call and realize that, he, hey, he's been using me. And I heard he has. Um, and I heard the final breakup this time. So I think they broke up in the past at least one time. For some, you might know these people. For some, you could be these people. I don't know. It's not me. But you plug in how it resonates. Okay, I heard there's about to be a very significant workplace injury of a femme nurse. She works in a nursing home. I heard they've been over, severely overworking her in a huge way. Um, and there's about to be a, a, a significant workplace injury of her. Um, um, and I heard they have not strategically not been hiring people um, in this facility. Um, I heard to give people many hours, but um, it's about to backfire. I don't know. I don't work in a nursing home. Y'all know this, but um, I feel for maybe you're one of somebody watches my channel. Maybe you work in this nursing home or either you're her or you're her co-workers or you know some this situation. How that resonates and applies. I didn't hear a sign on her, but she's fem energy. She works in a nursing home, so a skilled nursing facility. Um, and I heard they have strategically not been hiring new people in this facility, this one particular facility. I heard to get the employees in there a lot of hours. But I heard it's about to backfire because it's about to take out one of their main players in this nursing home because of some serious workplace injury. I heard it's, it's about to take her down um, and quit. I heard it's about to take her down and quit. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's a fall or um, a needle stick injury. I heard she's a nurse, so she could, I feel she may be LPN, RN, um, probably not an AP, RN, or a CRNP. I'm thinking of RN or LPN, but nursing home, I'm just saying. But, or however that resonates, but it's about to take her out, like out of the game. But this facility has strategically not been hiring anybody else, new employees in this particular facility to give the other employees in this facility, a lot of hours. So a lot of overtime, a lot of pay, blah, 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 blah. But it's about to backfire because it's about to take out one of our main game, game changers up in here with a workplace injury. I heard an investigation is going to be performed and it's not going to go well in other areas for this facility just now. So some kind of investigation is going to be performed, I guess, when she starts filing workman's comp or um, what have you, what have you, or how that resonates. Um, and it's going to... Um, spur some kind of investigation of her. It's not going to go well for this facility in other areas. So I'm assuming not the actual workplace injury because it sounds like that's going to be real. But something to do with other areas of something else in this this skilled nursing facility, this nursing home. I heard it's in a city. It's in a city. So it's a city in this urbanized area. However that resonates. Oh. Okay, I just heard a um, camera. Um, I heard a camera that a family member has placed with the consent, or specifically with the consent of the resident in a nursing home. Um, I heard they've been gathering evidence of nursing home abuse, and I heard they um, they almost have it. And I heard through many series of chain events this next week, they're about to have a huge, um, um, I heard major reporting, a huge major reporting 
um, seal in the deal. I just heard seal in the deal. A huge major recording on this um, hit, um, camera device that's placed in the residence room with the residence consent with the family member that's about to seal the deal. They're trying to prove resident abuse, um, nursing home abuse. And our, our, this week, upcoming this week, it's about to, it sounds like they already have evidence, but this week with this camera that has been, when they can do that, residents can place hidden cameras in their homes, in their, um, which their room is considered their home if they reside in a skilled nursing facility for anybody who doesn't know that. They can do that because um, it's, they're paying for that, that room at the skilled nursing facility. Uh, but the, it sounds like the family member has convinced the resident to do it. For some, you could be the family member, but y'all have been trying to prove resident abuse. And I heard you almost got it, but this week, there's about to be a huge thing that sounds like about to happen in this resident's room or related to this resident that's about to be calling camera. Sounds like in the room that's about to, I heard still the deal. I heard winning lawsuit, winning lawsuit. So you play, well, congratulations. All right. I love you guys. I'm getting out of here. Namaste.